coverage here at the Impact Fight League weigh-ins with the man who will challenge for the middleweight title, Hector El Toro Urbina. Hector, how are you? I'm doing great, man. How are you yourself? I'm great. How was the weight cut for the fight? The weight cut was really not that bad, you know, as long as you uh, consume the right food and, you know, follow a good diet, you know, it's never that bad. But uh, it was great, actually. I enjoyed it. Who was helping you train for this fight? Well, Bubba McDaniel is one of my uh, main training partners. Uh, I have gone out to other, you know, boxing gyms and such, uh, things like that. Um, you know, jujitsu and all that. I kind of, like I said, Bubba. Bubba's my main guy. You know, Bubba McDaniel's the man. Is Brandon Segan, he's your opponent. What do you think of him? What do you think his strengths are? What do you think his weaknesses are? And what are you looking to exploit in this fight? Brandon Segan's a hell of a fighter. I followed him. I've seen him. You know, I'm seeing. I, uh, his fighting's very, very, very technical, and he's well, well-rounded, and I, and, I, and I realize this, but in the end, he's just another man. I mean, you two are very battle-tested. You've been in there with a lot of good guys. Where does he rank as far as fighters you've fought before? This is a, a hell of a matchup, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I haven't fought in a little bit or in a little bit over a year, so it's a comeback for me, so there's a lot on the line for me, you know what I'm saying? As well as for him, you know what I'm saying? It's a fight, and... Uh, I want this really well, and yeah, I would I would say that he's a high-ranked fight for me, you know what I'm saying, a very, very tough fight, I'm ready for it, you know what I'm saying, it's my job. Is this a one-fight deal, or is this multiple fights? I mean, as long as there's money, man, we can make it a multiple-fight deal, you know what I'm saying? But are you looking for this fight to propel you to the big stage, because you fought in Bellator, is this kind of, you know, the fight that you think is going to propel you, if taking out a guy who's fought, you know, Dennis Kang, Martin Kamins, guys like that? Yeah, this definitely puts me back on the market, puts me back in the eye of the public, puts me right back where I left off at, basically. Um, like I said, this there's a lot at stake for me here, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, and yeah, you know, I, 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 I think that uh, it's definitely going to open up doors for me after I win. Without revealing too much, what's the game plan going in? Attack, attack, attack. In the words of my wrestling coach, Brian Beecher. Prediction? Really? I mean, right hands to his face, man, you know what I'm saying? Well, round. Probably second. I'll give him better for the doubt. All right. Good luck tomorrow night. Thank you so much. Thank you.